All right, guys, we are now at my beautiful ha -ha, uh, laptop, uh, clean. As you can like, clearly see it, it really needs to be cleaned. Anyway, so we got USB-C ports on this side and on this side. So I cannot put in the Ledger device right now as it is. If you guys can, then you can just skip this slice of the video and you know go to the next one. But if you have a uh, laptop, this is a MacBook right here, and it does not have the proper USB port for the Ledger, just get one of these bad boys. You know, something similar to this. It's got one USB-C in, and it's got one regular USB in. So I'm just gonna pop this right in over here. Now the ledger's ready to go in, and that'll be in the next slice. So I'm almost ready to get started, almost ready to plug the ledger into the laptop, but note, it does say under it to set up your device, follow the instructions at ledger.com slash start. It does say to charge your device before the first use by connecting the USB cable to a power source. So I'm just powering this bad boy up right now. And you can see it says, welcome to Ledger Nano X. Please, or sorry, press right button to continue. That's that dude right there. Thanks for focusing. All right, so we'll do that. But as you saw here, you gotta go to ledger.com slash start. So this is what the web page looks like. Ledger.com slash start. It says Ledger Live is our own software allowing you to set up your device and manage your crypto assets. Gotta download it. So now we're gonna go to the screen, uh, screen recording portion of the video and you know, it'll look a lot prettier. All right guys, here we go. Getting ready for the Ledger. 